Hi, guys. Um, so, it's late at night and I just got out of the shower, so I probably look really horrible right now. But, um, I just wanted to make this video, this really, um, I guess quick, I'm not even sure, um, on how I do my quick and easy, um, heatless curls. A lot of you, if you're like girls and you probably search how you can do heatless curls without damaging your hair, and you've probably seen a lot of sock curls, things like that, but I have like the foolproof, amazing curls. It's perfect, it's heatless, and it looks beautiful. I do it every time I have curly hair. It looks amazing. It's I think it looks better than a curling iron. And I use um, socks, but I use like long, stretchy socks, and I do it a different way so it doesn't look the same as other um, videos, I guess. But, um, so yeah, I'm just going to do this and show you how I do it, and then tomorrow morning I'll show you what the results are. And it's really great, and I think you'll like it, because I love it very much. It's like that perfect curling iron, curling iron curl that everyone's looking for, but they can't get it just right, and this, this works. Um, so first I just got to brush my hair. Um, you can have your hair damp or dry, whichever one. If you do it dry it will definitely make the curls tighter and I just sleep with it overnight and it stays overnight and it looks amazing I just leave my hair a little damp sometimes I do it with my hair dry but it like makes your hair super tight curls and I like it to be a little loose and wavy so I just brush my crazy hair and then take a small strand like this and I'm gonna look really crazy. Don't go outside looking like this. You'll look nuts. And you take the sock and you put it right under the strand of hair and you just twist it around like it's a curling iron. And just keep twisting it around. Just keep twisting, twisting. This thing and then when you get to the bottom with this little last strand of hair a lot of girls don't do this right where they just with the little last strand of hair they just leave it and then tie the two ends you're supposed to grab the flap and then put this little strand left over inside the flap tightly and grab the two ends put it in the hole and tie it like it's a shoelace and make sure it's tight I look absolutely crazy. So if you're a guy and you're watching this, I'm terribly sorry that you have to see this. Or anyone for that matter. <laughs> and you just try and get it as close to the root as possible because it'll look more natural and it'll look like really pretty. And try and leave the strands to not be too thick or too thin because it has to be just right or else it'll look just strange. <laughs> Okay, so I'm done with this side of my hair, so um, to do the other side I have to grab my bangs because I don't want to curl my bangs because I just do that with my hair straightener after I take the curls out um, and I just move to the other side so I can have all the long hair here and oh my god this is going to look really crazy. <laughs> You know, just take a stretchy sock. That's weird. Just put a sock up to my face. <laughs> Sorry.
So after you're done and you look like a fucking maniac, like I do, you just go to sleep or do whatever you want to do for a few hours and I recommend just doing it before bed and then it'll be all ready for you in the morning, which I'm going to go to bed right now and I'll show you what it looks like in the morning. So that way you don't think I just put a bunch of socks in my hair for no reason. So yeah, good night. Uh, good morning. Um, I'm sick, so uh, I just got sick overnight and I don't feel good and I'm really tired and I got pimples going all kinds of places and I'm really upset. Sorry if my voice sounds horrible. But yeah, so this is what it looks like after I wake up, like a little strand fell out, that happened sometimes, I guess I was tossing and turning, tossing and turning. So yeah, all you do is you take out the sock like this and you just unroll it and it might look all weird at first but I'll show you what you can do to make it not look weird. Pretty little curl. Hey. Next one. You unroll it. Sometimes it's hard to unroll because hairs get stuck in random places. And that really, really sucks. <laughs> But it's all good. It's not even noticeable. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna show you how I complete it so it doesn't look all super tight and crazy. Cause I know it looks super tight and crazy right now and you're probably thinking, the fuck bitch, you make me do this to my hair? And like, it don't even look good. What the hell? And then I'm gonna be like, no, no, stop, listen, listen. There's ways to fix it so it looks good, okay? Just calm down. It usually doesn't take me this long to unroll it, but I'm like trying to show you, I guess. It usually takes me really fast, and I don't have a mirror right now, so I can't see what the fuck I'm doing. Sorry, I cussed. I cussed too much. I don't know why I said that. Alright, I'm gonna take out this piece. Ooh, 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 unroll it, unroll it, unroll it. Alright, so it looks all short and crazy and super curly, but I'm gonna fix it in a minute, okay? And what you do is, now that it's all crazy and crap, alright, take some hairspray, shake it all up till it's all nice and hard. Oh, sorry. That wasn't appropriate. Alright, and then cover your face. And, like, make sure it's not hitting very closely. Lightly hairspray it. Make sure your bangs don't get in the way. Take your bangs like that. And then just... Okay. Now it's all nicely hairsprayed and looking swell. Not really though. No. You take a brush. This part's optional. If you like it looking this way, then you can keep it looking this way. But I take a brush. And this is going to look crazy in a minute. <laughs> And I brush it, and even though it's gonna get super fluffy and crazy, watch, 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 watch. I show you. You just brush it, and then here's what you do. You don't run your fingers through it. You just do this, yep. Because 
this way it will stop being as crazy and you'll get more of that natural cute looking wavy look which it always does that by the time I get to school because it's usually for the UK until I get to school and then it's like oh now you want to look cute but you're not going to look cute in the morning sorry I talked to my ears and nose I guess that's just me the girl Alright, and then I take this side of my hair, and I bobby pin this shit, so that way it doesn't look super flipping crazy. And then I take my bangs, and I get a hair straightener, and I just... The picture in the um, video is going to be a picture of my hair after I get back home from school because I don't have enough time for all that shit right now. After like about an hour, it should start to fall a little bit and look a little more loose and pretty and it always does that. But yeah, so I just do this and it looks like just beautiful curl curls. Easy and heatless and beautiful. It works. So yeah, that's all I got for you. Um, I'm just gonna go now because it's time for me to go. And uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe and stuff and um. <laughs>